The COVID-19 Delta variant. Everything you need to know. Here's what you need to know as COVID cases rise again. More than a year after the COVID-19 epidemic began, a new wave of cases is emerging as the highly transmissible Delta variant spreads across the United States and the world. Should you be concerned, given that the variant is more than 50% more contagious than the original COVID strain? Are you protected if you're completely vaccinated? What causes the COVID-19 virus to mutate? Viruses are all capable of mutating, it's not uncommon for numerous strains of the same virus to propagate at the same time, as is the case with COVID variations. The influenza virus is a wonderful example of this. Each year, the flu virus evolves, and we change our technique to keep up, we watch how the COVID-19 virus code changes, much as we do with the flu virus, to alter our approach and understanding of it. Most mutations are harmless, but others, for example, cause the virus to become more contagious. That's exactly what the COVID-19 Delta version is doing right now. What is the Delta version, and how does it differ from other variants? In late 2020, the COVID-19 Delta variant first appeared. It has since expanded throughout several countries, including the United States, and is now the most common COVID-19 form. In fact, the Delta form accounts for more than 90% of COVID-19 instances in the United States today. This percentage is larger in other states, notably those with lower immunization rates. Scientists have determined that the Delta form of COVID-19 is more transmissible than other COVID-19 variations. People who haven't been completely immunized are especially vulnerable. This COVID-19 variety may be more likely to bypass the body's defenses, and it's more likely to appear in those who have partial immunity. If you aren't fully vaccinated, the best course of action right now is to get vaccinated against COVID-19 and take preventive steps like practicing good hand hygiene, wearing a mask, and physically separating yourself from others in public. Do the COVID-19 immunizations protect against the Delta strain of the virus? COVID-19 vaccines from Pfizer, Moderna, and Johnson & Johnson have been found to be effective against some COVID-19 variations, notably the Delta form, in tests so far. While none of the vaccines are 100% effective in preventing disease, major infections in fully vaccinated people appear to be uncommon. Even though the vaccine protects you from Delta, you can still pass it on to others. This is why the CDC recommends that everyone including fully vaccinated people, wear a mask in public indoor settings if they are in a location with significant or high transmission. Most Pennsylvania counties are rapidly approaching this level. If you're still on the fence about getting the vaccine, COVID-19 variants show why it's a good idea for you and your family, especially youngsters. A study conducted in the United Kingdom found that youngsters and individuals under the age of 50 were 2.5 times more likely to become infected with the Delta variant. It's crucial to note that COVID affects people of all ages, not simply the elderly and those with chronic illnesses. Everyone is in danger. If you've had all of your vaccinations, you might be wondering if you need a booster shot. There is currently no definitive answer. Scientists are still researching whether or not a booster is needed. What are the methods for detecting and treating variants? Even in its various forms, the COVID-19 virus may now be detected. While strain identification is crucial, it has little bearing on how we identify or treat COVID-19 patients. Regardless of the presence of variations, the necessity of having your COVID-19 immunization cannot be overstated. It's the best defenses against COVID-19 and its derivatives, such as Delta. The more individuals we vaccinate, the better chance we have of staying ahead of variants, the fewer viruses that circulate in our societies, the less likely they are to mutate.